Yes, good evening, and that's right. This press conference just wrapped up a few minutes ago, and federal prosecutors are charging three alleged gang members and an associate with federal charges, and that's because Sheriff Alex Villanueva says he did not want local district attorney George Gascon prosecuting this case because he says Gascon was not adding to plan, was not planning to add gang enhancements. Now, take a look. We want to show you the names of these suspects. The suspects are identified as 29-year-old Luis Alfredo de la Rosa Rios, 22-year-old Ernesto Cisneros, 34-year-old Jesse Contreras, and 18-year-old Haley Grisham, who is the girlfriend of one of the alleged gang members. And at a federal level, they're charged with violent crime in aid of racketeering, which carries a potential death penalty and minimum life sentence in federal prison with no parole. And Sheriff Villanueva says they did not want District Attorney Gascon prosecuting this case. Take a listen. If the district attorney, that's their prosecutorial stance, we, we have the freedom and the ability to apply and look for other, other uh, sources of prosecution. Is this a rebuke to George Gasco? I think it speaks for itself, really. Police say Officer Arroyos and his girlfriend were looking at a home on East 87th Street when a black pickup truck with the four suspects pulled up. Two of the suspects allegedly confronted Arroyos and his girlfriend, pointing guns and robbing them, including taking Arroyos's chains. And after taking the chains, police say Arroyos and the suspects started shooting at each other, and Arroyos died from his injuries. Now, he was off duty when the shooting happened, and his devastated mother told us Wednesday Arroyos wanted to be an officer since he was a child. Take a listen. Somebody say my son is dying this away. It's terrible for me. He say always, I want to please, I want to please. Mm -hmm. He go to Berkeley, he graduation for honors and everything. But he say always, he say, I want to police and he's police. <laughs> And Arroyos was an officer with the LAPD for three years, and we're told that these suspects will now be moved into federal custody tomorrow morning, and they will also be arraigned tomorrow morning. So we'll, of course, keep track of this developing story. Reporting live this evening, I'm Coco McAvoy, Fox 11 News. Yeah, George Gasco noticeably absent from that press conference.